This year for Thanksgiving, we at HCA have something very special to be thankful for. However, before we share what it is, let's talk about the path God has led us down beforehand. Oftentimes in life, we allow the truth to become disordered because of our feelings, emotions, faulty logic, or lack of faith. Sometimes we forget that the truth is the truth, no matter what we feel or think. Take for example the simple math problem. 2 plus 2 equals 4. No matter what, 2 plus 2 will always equal 4. No matter if we really want it to equal something else, no matter if we feel it should equal something else, no matter if our logic tells us it should equal something else. The fact is, the truth is the truth. Two plus two will always equal four. With this principle in mind, let's travel back to early August of this year. It was then that we initiated our first fundraiser for a new school van. The two vans that we had were in desperate need of replacement as they were unreliable and constantly breaking down. This was a difficult situation to be in because school was starting, and a decent used 15-passenger van could easily cost $15,000. We were stressed, but Matthew 19.26 states, With men, this is impossible, but with God, all things are possible. You see, no matter how stressed we are, 2 plus 2 equals 4. The truth is the truth. God is God and he can do anything he wishes. Fast forward to mid-September. The Facebook fundraiser drive and the golf scramble were now over, and they were a great success. Parents, alumni, and a few outside sources came together in these events to raise over $12,000. We had greatly exceeded our original goal of $8,000, and many were excited about what God was doing. So once again, we learned the lesson. The truth is the truth. Two plus two always equals four, no matter what we think. God is God, and He always exceeds our expectations. Ephesians 3.20 He is able to do exceedingly and abundantly above all that we ask or think according to the power that worketh in us. And so, with money in hand, we began shopping. However, one thing started to become painfully obvious. As we looked at different price tags of the 15 passenger vans in the area, we could see that we clearly didn't have enough money. $14,000, $16,000, even $18,000 seemed to be the going rates for a decent vehicle. Nevertheless, we kept looking. James 1, 6 through 8. Well, let him ask in faith, nothing wavering. For he that wavereth is like a wave of the sea, driven with the wind and tossed. For let not that man think that he shall receive anything of the Lord. A double-minded man is unstable in all his ways. Remember, two plus two always equals four, even if we don't believe it. God is God. Faith pleases him, and he is the rewarder of them that diligently seek him. After weeks of prayer, hours of online searching, and several trips to different counties, we finally found it. A beautiful 2010 Chevy with only 27,000 miles on it. The interior was practically brand new, and with a final loan from one of our alumni, we were able to purchase it for a great price. It is the most beautiful and mechanically sound 15-passenger van we have ever owned. Matthew 7, 9 through 11. What man is there of you, whom if his son asks bread, will he give him a stone? If ye then, being evil, know how to give good gifts unto your children, how much more shall your Father, which is in heaven, give good things to them that ask him? The truth is the truth. Two plus two equals four. No matter if we expect it to be less, God is God and he loves to bless his children with good things. And with that, our search for a van came to a close. We were beyond excited, and I prepared to begin editing an appreciation video. However, one question still loomed in my mind. What about a second van? Could we really rely on the green van for the rest of the year? You see, the reality of the situation was that we needed two new vans, not just one. 
But that's where I forgot one important thing. The truth is the truth. And God is always one step ahead. He provides for his children, even before they think to ask. Matthew 6, 8. Your Father knoweth what things ye need of, before ye ask him. Philippians 4, 19. But my God shall supply all your needs according to his riches and glory by Christ Jesus. Yes, it was true. God had provided a second van at literally zero monetary cost to the school. It was donated in exchange for services rendered. Of course, God had it planned out all ahead of time. He even made sure the colors of the vans matched perfectly. Both are mechanically sound, and both will provide many years of service to the school. They are beautiful vehicles, and every time we look at them, they will serve as a constant reminder of one simple lesson. The truth is the truth. God is God, and there is no one like Him. Matthew 6, 31-33 Therefore take no thought, saying, What shall we eat, or what shall we drink, or wherewithal shall we be clothed? For your heavenly Father knoweth that ye have need of all these things. But seek ye first the kingdom of God, and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added unto you. James chapter 1, verse 17 Every good gift and every perfect gift is from above and cometh down from the Father of lights, with whom is no variableness, neither shadow of turning. Have a wonderful Thanksgiving, everyone. Remember, two plus two will always equal four, and God will always do what he says he will do.